Boom, 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 boom. Welcome back, welcome back to Maurice's Polo Review Channel. Today we will be talking about what's on my mannequin along with a new cop. So let's get into it. Um, I hope everybody's having a productive um, weekend. This is my only day off, so I'm just trying to get it done. Stay with good content. Um, I hope everybody's having a blessed and safe weekend. Um, also, shout out to my boy Nacho Loren for the shoot up in Philadelphia and all my Lokis that went up there to support them. Great turnout, positive vibes, everything went good. So that is absolutely great. So let's get into what's on my mannequin. So let me adjust everything right. So we talked about it last week. We're going with the um, <laughs> Indian head thing. <laughs> so this rugby piece, this is the one I was uh, harping about as far as imperfections and people not telling the truth about their particular items. So I got the buttons replaced for those who have this particular item in your closet. Understand that these, these buttons had to be replaced. I couldn't walk around with two buttons that was halfway broken or whatever the case may be. So I had to do what I had to do. <clears throat> so with that being said, I have the blue oxygen up under him. You know, a nice preppy look. You know, anybody who knows anything about Ralph Lauren knows it's gonna be a rugby piece. Um, also have the the uh, leather scrap on the side. If anybody go hunting this, you know, you already know what it is. That's for your barrel whenever it's hot. That way you don't burn yourself. Um, and the inner head with this cardigan. It's a, it's a very detailed item to myself. Um, it stands out just because of the uniqueness of this particular piece. And it's a very nice, clean look. You know, if you wanted to rock a, a tie with it, you could. Um, myself, personally, I'm not going to rock a tie. So I'll just have it like this and, you know, probably rock out with a hat, some glasses or something. Not necessarily doing too much. So that's just me and everybody else have their own particular style. So I know a lot of people are seeing what's going on in the back. Um... I'm taking down the shelves and I'm getting some I'm getting some more racks, you know, just to, you know, beef it up a little bit more. So that's what I'm doing back there. So I'm taking out all my clothes <laughs> and putting them in other places until my racks get here. Um, so let's get into my cop of the week. And it is a vintage piece. So let's talk about it. This week cop is drum roll please the polo sportsman jacket detailing upon this piece has, to me has always been immaculate um the detailing on the back as you see is a one um i like the vintage look as far as the fade you know you can rock a red shirt up under it a red sportsman shirt um to go with it it's just a dope piece to me and um, those who know this particular piece know it's going to run big, which I like. So it's more like a oversized shirt to me. Um, very nice piece. Has Polo Sport on the side of it, Ralph Lauren. Um, and it's, it's just, it just gives you a outdoors feel whenever you want to rock this particular piece. Um, I could see myself rocking this, you know, like I said, with a red sportsman shirt. Probably the same color as the back as far as the, the coloring goes. You know, nice, you know, probably ain't doing too much, you know, but this will be the focal point of my particular outfit for that day, you know. And um, it also has the, the pockets in the back that go straight through for your gun or... I guess your fishing poles in this particular instance, if you don't feel like carrying them. Um, so, yeah, that's my cop of the week. And now I do have some more cops that's coming. I got to take some to the cleaners just to get clean. You know how that thing goes. Um, also, just, you know, wanted to touch on being positive, you know, things and uh, things may come your way. And some things you can't help, you're going to get blessings and, you know, you're going to have issues in your life. Understand with every problem, there is a learning lesson in that. And with that being said, you got to stay positive and you got to learn from that particular, uh, that particular situation, you know. And then on top of it, let's talk about understanding. 
Okay, understanding something with people is not necessarily putting yourselves in their shoes because everybody have their own trials and tribulations in life. And people take different aspects of their trials and tribulations and apply that to their life in everyday situations. But to interact with somebody who may who may have a negative outlook upon your life is not only a distraction to me. It's a distraction. And the only reason why I say that is because people will try to in, people will try to force their opinions about your life on you when they haven't walked not one day in your shoes. So with that being said, understand people like that, you need to get them out your lives, period. You know, I always try to be on a positive tip, you know, in life, period, regardless of whatever the situation may be. If it's not affecting me, my family, my wife, and um, my friends, I mean, in a negative light, I mean, I'm going to always be positivity, but sometimes you got to cut people off because people don't want you to be happy. People don't want you to succeed. People don't want um, your 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 goals to be accomplished by yourself because they want to hinder that. And once they hinder that, they're ending your, your train of thought. So with that being said, I would like to thank each and every one of you for coming to Maurice Sapolo Review Channel. Like, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. It's all positivity over here. And um, yeah. And also, let's talk about something else. I was about to end it, but let's talk about something else. If you could bring back one or two lines of Ralph Lauren, what would it be? Question mark. Also, what are you looking forward to upcoming with Ralph Lauren and his line? Or what would you want to have in your collection that you don't have? So let's talk about it in the comments below. Uh, like I said before, tell a friend to tell a friend. And thank you. Oh, yeah. I got a plug, too. I got, got a plug y'all in, too. I got a friend at work. His name is uh, Richard. And he has a YouTube channel. It's not a clothing. It's not about raffler and about no clothes. Um, it's about small engines um, on lawnmowers. Hey, it's a pretty dope channel. And his name is Rusty Rooster. And um, very cool guy. Very cool guy. Um, very funny. And um, also, I got another friend, Carrie James, Hot Coles. Um, I forget, Carrie, sorry. But, yeah, he haven't posted in a minute, but he needed to get back to posting to YouTube. Um, so, those are my shout-outs. So, also, i like to thank Sun Low for um, sending me a particular item that I have been searching for for a minute. And when I get here, I will be posting it. So, with that being said, thank you and have a blessed day. Thank <laughs> you.